Looking ahead, a local nonprofit is launching an academic center to help some Hispanic families in East Tennessee. Yvonne Thomas shares how Ola Lakeway plans to help with virtual learning. Ola Lakeway is working hard. They're a nonprofit that's making sure that Hispanic or immigrant families have access to the resources that they need, especially if their children are returning to school online this year. Joining us today, we have Jessica Bailiff Noli with us. Thank you for being here with Thank us. Thank you. Talk to us about this project. It's definitely been a labor of love, this academic center. It absolutely has. Um, Betsy and I both work in education, so we know that there's a big need in our area. Um, and with schools going on virtual or some in person, but the students still may need some academic support. So we wanted to have a place where not only they could come as a Wi-Fi hotspot and use our internet, but also could get academic support, tutoring, and for families who do not have their own computer to bring, we have some that have been donated that they can come and use that will be sanitized and nice and clean. And we just wanna provide as much support as we can for their students and their education. Now we know a lot of these items, especially for the center, have been donated. Are yes, you all still accepting donations? Absolutely. What do We're, you need? We are always accepting donations. Right now we have a need for computers. We have three laptops so far that have been donated. We would like to have about 10 or so, so we can support as many families as this room will hold. Um, and we also, or so accepting cleaning supplies so we can keep this as a safe environment, um, financial donations to help families who may have been affected by coronavirus. We've been helping them financially some, so always accepting donations and they're greatly appreciated. Absolutely. Jessica, thank you so much. Thank we really appreciate it. We'll have more details about how you can donate any of these supplies or donate funds on our website. The Academic Center should open on September the 8th.